E-W-L-O. The prints are right here. They're $23.75. Uh, the high today was $34.45. This is a 15-minute after-hours chart. The minute that we've seen the stock slipping, we sorted this stock in after-hours, as you can see. And not only that, you can see the 15-minute drop in prices right here. They missed their earnings big time. And we have 7.8 million shares that are being traded right now on TWLO in the after-hours market. And, you know, there was a lot of bulls that were on this trade. We didn't really need it. The post earnings is the biggest loser in the after hours. They beat by three cents, beats on revs, guides Q2 below consensus, lowers fiscal 17th guidance below consensus. One of the things that's very disturbing for them is the fact that year over year, one of the things that we take a look is that revenue structure of 87.4 million versus 83.5 and we take a look at that area but the most important is company issues downside guidance for q2 period company issues downside guidance for fiscal 17 lowers the earning per share to minus 30 to minus 27 and reoccurring items i'll go over the rest of it um, with everybody as far as the fundamentals go and whatnot. And you can see right here that we're printing at 23.75. This is the biggest quarterly after hour earnings report today. And once again, when I give out these orders and they start to go down, you hit that, you pound that short. That's exactly what the turbo option traders did intraday. Now, one of the things, it dives 21% in after hours, and there's lots of reasons why. They were losing more money, and they could not meet their estimates. So, the stock is going to have a hangover for a considerable amount of time. Um, and those revenues, well, they're not sustainable. And therefore, we've got a double guidance down, and this is what happens to stocks that do not make their earnings and we're up big time on this stock right now in the after hours we sorted it the minute that that report hit we weren't exactly at the high but we damn sure were down here at 32 dollars that's where our entries were when that headline hit and then it started dropping like a rock and it did and now we're down here on a 15 minute at 23.85, that is a super big, big trading after hours.